Hi everyone, I'm Laurencio, and in this video I'm going to talk about all NASCAR games for the Nintendo GameCube. NASCAR Thunder 2003 is decent. You get a quick race option, season and career. In season you try to accumulate the most points to win the season, whereas career is a series of seasons. The career mode spans over 20 years, so you have what to play, and it's nice that the career mode isn't just racing. You get to customize your vehicle, choose the color, number, sponsor, you can buy new performance upgrades, and you do lots of manager stuff too in the career. You can strike deals or refuse. In the career mode you can even skip races, you can simulate the races and just do the manager stuff only, if you want. Also the game has another game mode, the lightning challenge, where you recreate some historical moments from NASCAR and try to change history by winning. The driving itself is strategic, you have to watch for your tires not to wear off, you have to watch for your fuel, you have to drag and overtake where there's an occasion. The game can get pretty challenging and NASCAR fans talk good about the game, so if you're a NASCAR fan, you should check out the game. Even me, a guy who's not into NASCAR, liked the game. NASCAR Dirt to Daytona is fantastic, even for non-NASCAR fans. The game is set like the Dirt series. You get a hub from where you manage everything, from here you recruit mechanics, update your car, put sponsor stickers on it, close deals with sponsors and select races. The gameplay is as simulation as the technology of the GameCube could handle. And the driving feels fantastic. And there are four vehicle types you will have to race in. One complaint people had with the game was the lack of damage models. I wasn't bothered by it, but I thought to mention it since so many people don't like the lack of damage you see on the vehicles. But aside of that, the game is fantastic. NASCAR 2005 Chase to the Top is another fantastic game. This one has a story too. You start the game by racing Ryan Newman and after he sees your skills, he helps you get a name for yourself. In this game you don't race with just one car type, but with multiple types of vehicles as the game spans in different cups. Also the game has an honor meter. If you drive dirty and slam into other drivers, you get fame for being such a driver. Or you can change the meter to heroic if you drive clean, but it's easier to progress in the game by driving dirty. And if you drive like that, you can see drivers fight after the race. And you even get the option to apologize to you for your driving or not, you, you can refuse to apologize. Also the AI reacts different depending on your driving style. And the game gets even crazier. By getting more money, you can sponsor other drivers, and they offer you a cut of their winnings. Overall the game is amazing, it has a lot of attention to detail. You should give it a try even if you're not a NASCAR fan. The gameplay is great, the cars handle great, you get a ton of cars, the huge amount of cars you get in this game is amazing. Also you get a character creation tool. In the career you have so many options, it's crazy. Just try out the game. Even if you're not an NASCAR fan, you are most probably going to like this game. I mean, I'm not an NASCAR fan and I loved the game. Just give it a try, you'll see what an amazing game it is. Okay, so this was the video. If you liked it, please hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to financially support me in my pursuit to review as many video games as possible, you can do that on Patreon or on the channel's membership section. You will help me a lot. If you want, you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord. And if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and there will be thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.